Atlanta Plugged In starts now. Prostate cancer has often been thought of to only affect men in their 70s and 80s. However, modern research shows that younger men are being diagnosed at an increasing rate. Here to tell us about a new outpatient treatment called HIFU is Dr. Vahan Kasavian, a leading urological surgeon in Atlanta. Welcome, Dr. Kasavian. Nice Thank you, Esther. Nice to have you here. Okay, so first of all, I just want to tell us what are some early signs of prostate cancer that might be overlooked? So fortunately, prostate cancer, we want to catch it in the early stages mm -hmm. when there are no symptoms. Mm -hmm. It's usually caught with either a rectal exam or a blood test called the PSA, prostate specific antigen. When prostate cancer grows, it can cause urinary issues, it can cause sexual issues, and if it's spread to other parts of the body, it can cause bone pain or loss of appetite. But we really want to catch it early when there are no symptoms. Okay, now does prostate cancer always mean that there's a loss of intimate function? Not always. In, oh. in fact, with the treatment HIFU, it has the best chance of preserving sexual function. That's really important to men. Now what is HIFU and who are the best candidates for this treatment? HIFU stands for High Intensity Focused Ultrasound. Okay. And if you remember as a child, you can take a magnifying glass to sunlight and burn a leaf. Mm -hmm. Well, here we're using ultrasound waves to beam them and create heat and destroy uh, the prostate cancer cells and prostate tissue. It's a minimally invasive outpatient procedure that typically takes less than two hours and patients go home the same day with a catheter. All right, perfect. I think people would like to know that. Now, I know that uh, we were mentioned that younger people are being diagnosed with this, but tell us why. Because we are pro very proactive here in the urologic community in the United States. We do blood tests, uh, the shows of the PSA, we do rectal exams. In other countries around the world, they don't uh, use as much PSA, so men typically get diagnosed at a later age and a later stage, unfortunately. All right, thank you, Dr. Kasavian. I appreciate you being with us. Now, to learn more about Dr. Kasavian and the rest of the team at Advanced Urology, you can visit advancedurology.com.